it haunts me every day that I don't know what happened. Um, I, I just don't remember. The man accused in the deadly Sweet Tomatoes crash takes the stand in his own defense. Brad Kassler is accused of killing two people when his SUV slammed into a busy pizza shop in Newton Corner. And today, he became emotional while telling the jury his side of the story. WBC's Christina Hager has the story. It haunts me every day that I don't know what happened. Brad Kassler finally breaking his silence after more no. than two and a half years about his part in the crash that wiped out Wes Newton's Sweet Tomatoes Pizza Shop and killed Eleanor Mealy and Gregory Morin. As I'm driving, I uh, felt weird. My body felt strange to me, um, which had not happened before. The car was speeding up, and I just didn't know what's, what was happening. I just couldn't control it at that time. As Kassler testified about his multiple sclerosis, which his attorney says is what caused the crash, his brother listened at times, his head hanging. My younger brother uh, has MS. Um, MS um, excuse me. Is not a right term. And later, over prosecutor objections, Kassler blurted out a key phrase which the jury heard before the judge ordered it be taken out of the record. I was never advised not to drive. This after three days of testimony from victims and first responders, including those who said he denied at the scene his MS had anything to do with it. Today, he says he has no memory of that, though he wishes he did. I think about it all day long. I think about it at night. I wake up and shake at night lately since that day. More testimony about multiple sclerosis up next. And if all goes as planned, this case will be in the hands of the jury by Friday. In Woburn, Christina Hager, WBZ News.